said. Jello. Yeah, jello. You put that in the water. Oh, that's good. Look how and, pretty that and is. And then you add a quarter teaspoon of salt. All right. Are we supposed to wait for the water to boil well, before yeah, you put before that in? Yeah, before I there? put it in. So that's I all right. Get the general. So we're faking this. Yeah. Anyhow. So this is. I mean, they're showing this. This is not looking the way it's supposed to. But it that's probably. All right. You know. So once that starts going in, all of that dissolves in there. Yeah. Then you add another quarter cup of cold. Oh, I should probably take that off the heat. Well, it's not it boiling yet. Matter. It oh, I'll just turn off just a bit. Breaks out and then a, three quarters of a cup of cold water. Okay. Then you take oh vinegar. Ooh, now <laughs> you're talking. All right, hold on. You take two mm. tablespoons of vinegar. Yeah. Oh, oh geez. that's well, close a, enough. It's a little. It's a little bit a much. Splash. It's just. You get it's it just to <laughs> take a little liberty. It's your recipe. It smells delightful. And then this is interesting. So you take. I, I've never used one of these. Oh yeah. What is that? It's a grater. Okay. And so you grate some onion. Ooh. All right. And you're supposed to take two teaspoons of this grated onion ah. right. and put that in the water. Well, it, it's there's not really any on here now, but so you'll get the idea. Teaspoons? Two teaspoons of it. So you, it's really oh, like half of onion. half of this half of an onion. And okay. so you mix all that up. Then you have to wait. You put that in the refrigerator till it gets really thick. So All like right. for an hour, we it has to get. It's not a full molded Jello yet, but it's thick liquid. Okay. Fair so enough. I don't have time to do that. But once yeah, it's yeah. done, that's when you're adding this lovely array of things. All right. What do we that's have gonna on That's going to go in the Jello. So here we have like a half cup of celery. All right. It's a can and a half of tuna. Nice. A uh, half a cup of. Cucumbers. Cucumbers. I love um, cucumbers. A couple of tablespoons of sliced olives. Sure, sure, sure. And some pimento. I didn't even know they sold that separately. Mother's some Day of that. is going to be a delight. So this all goes right. That goes in, in there too. Yes, once it's thickened up, you know. So this it, is I awesome. haven't officially thickened it up yet. So we got some sweet vinegar and <laughs> onion, onion, tuna, and olives. All I mean, right. it's just, it's just that it's, sounds good. Then you, it's going to be really mucky and and thick, yeah. you know. So you mix Keep all the, that up. Keep uh, the animals out of the kitchen. At this right. point, because they're likely <laughs> going to try to dive in there and get. So then some. you remember this from my spaghetti yeah. surprise. <laughs> yes, I do. So I borrowed that from D again. Yeah, thanks, And D. then you're going to pour all of this deliciousness. Yeah. It'll be thick at this wow. point, kind of half thick. Yeah. <laughs> it's got a little bit of a vomit consistency <laughs> to it, which is a nice yeah. little twist. It's really. Look how pretty that look is. Look at though. the colors are really lovely yeah. though. My okay. My heavens. So that all goes in there, and you're going to refrigerate that overnight. Ideally, because it'll really get nice and, and hard and All hardened right. up there. And now, keep it in the refrigerator or leave it on the, the shelf overnight? In the refrigerator. In the refrigerator. So now, right. you know I'm all about the presentation. Oh, that's what this so is all about. So once it's done, you're going to kind of, you have to dip it in like hot water to loosen it up a okay. little bit. And all then, right. but once you get the, you know, your platter, yeah. you have to put some lettuce yeah, down. Yeah, you got to garnish it. And then you have to get some radishes, and I cut them into little roses. Come on. I did. Just all for me? Myself. Yeah, so it's like you have to use your knife and cut them like, you know, on angle. Anyway, yeah, I that's, a, some that that's a full time project. Full -time right job. There. But would you like to see the finished yeah, product? Yeah, you're darn right I would. Okay. I can't wait to eat it either. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> we. Wow. I, you have to give me points on presentation. Yeah, that's Here's like, the, so when you take it out, you put the lettuce around, you do yeah. these little radishes, and then you put more lettuce in the middle, and then two more cans of tuna right in the wow. middle. Your radishes are spectacular. Now, let Look me say that. this. They say in the recipe, when you serve it, yeah. some people like a dollop of mayonnaise Oh, yeah, I'd like a little <laughs> mayonnaise. Throw a little bit on there. Do you mind? Would you like that? Yeah, why All not? Right. So yeah. can I have the plate Sure, of there? course. Yeah, knock okay, yourself so out. I'm going to give you a nice... Look at how... Let's get it. I'm trying to cut through the... I never thought after all these years <laughs> yeah. that Robin would be cooking for me. Yeah. This will be like when we're at the old folks' home. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'll give you a little uh, radish. Now, you yeah. want mayo right on top? Yes, yeah, throw it on there. Do you, I have to eat the lettuce? You do not. All right, God, that lettuce. All right, we'll get that out of there. Yeah, that. All right, so how, right on top? Yeah, you want sure, it, like, why not? frosting or sure. just a dollop? Yeah, just a dollop. Right, oh, there you go. a little generous, but yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. So Polly. it's the combo. You put it all together. I guess the so. The tuna, tuna, the and jello, the jello. And the jello mold is exciting to me. Not as the consistency on the jello mold is a little. Um, all right. No. Now that's not bad. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. It's a little sweet and savory. You got jello, which is sweet, and then you got the tuna in there, which is salty. The mayonnaise, this is delightful. Yeah, you are mentally ill, I it think. It seems to There's me. There's something wrong with you. Someone please 
Anyone Larry. else want yeah. to try? You're a health nut. Come on over. I'm good. I thought you didn't like fish, though. No, oh, tuna's great. But, you know, there's some fish that if you leave it out oh. too long, <laughs> gets a little gamey. Maybe it's my skill that's making you, this so great. Listen, right? Hey, if you have a mother out there that you love, and you have good feelings about her, you are a fool. <laughs> if you do not make this for her on Mother's Day, this is spectacular. You're done right, Paul. The, Thank it's you. It's sweet. It's got to be healthy, also. Was there? Any, there was no sugar or anything in this. Just the Jello. No, you're right. It's a lot of healthy ingredients it's nice, in there. To me, you want a little bite? <laughs> you bite? It looks fantastic, but I'm. It's I'm magnificent. <laughs> Bites oh. for everybody. You can share the fork. We'll be right back. Come on. That was really good. <laughs> Sweet. Sweet. Oh.